All right, I have an update on the Brother Skitch PP1 embroider machine, and it's not really a good one. Welcome to the Sewing Report, I'm Jen. This channel is all about making sewing fun and approachable. And you can see I have the embroider machine here, but nothing's happening. So you're like, Jen, why is this machine just sitting here? And that is because I cannot get the machine to pair with the Art Spirit app. And as I mentioned, that is the only way you can use the machine. Most embroider machines, you operate it on the machine itself. It's got like a touch screen or an interface directly on the machine. This model, which is out new from Brother, does not have that. It's got like a start stop button. It has the Bluetooth connectivity button, an accept button, needle position, and a thread trimmer. But you can see there's nothing else here. So everything is operated on the Brother Art Spira app. This is a proprietary app from the brand and I'm going to bring it up right now and the thing is, I was getting all ready. I was excited. I was going to try to do an applique project for the first time on this thing and try to embroider a few different materials. And I haven't really had too many issues with the machine itself the first few days. But when I went to use it tonight, I was unable to pair the machine to the app. Now, when you use the machine, it runs on Bluetooth. So it's sort of like a wireless connectivity thing. Again, I've used it twice pretty heavy use the first few days, no issues, but tonight I just cannot get this thing to pair with the machine. So what you have to do to pair, you've got to like register the machine, click wireless or Bluetooth, get started, connect the machine, and then hit the Bluetooth button here until it beeps. So I'm doing that. And every time I do it, it just kind of spins out and then nothing happens. So I've tried a lot of different things thinking, well, maybe it's this or maybe it's that. But every single time I attempt to pair the machine, it just fails. Originally, I also had my brother PE900 also registered to it as well. It said you could only have one machine paired at a time, but I had both registered when I used it the first few times, no issues. Anyways, I did try to delete the PE900 thinking maybe that would help, I don't know. Other things I've tried include, I've just turned the machine off and then back on. I even kept it off for like a few minutes thinking maybe that was it. I've tried pairing it multiple times, but every time I do it just like times out. I've also tried uninstalling the app and then reinstalling the app. I've tried both on the iPhone and the iPad, and I was able to use both the phone and the iPad with the machine the first few days I had it without any issue. So at this point, I don't know what's going on, and I'm thinking what happens is the app will recognize the machine, like it'll pull up the machine name, but it just won't pair the machine. I'm actually thinking at this point, it might be a problem with the app itself and not really the machine, just because it is recognizing the machine, but it's not pairing. So no idea what the heck is going on, but this is fairly frustrating. And I think this really highlights the potential downside, the huge downside of having a machine that runs solely on an app solely on wireless connectivity and not on the machine itself because since I can't pair the machine, I can't use the machine at all. It will not do anything. And that's why this thing is just like sitting here. So, all right, we're gonna try to turn it off and back on. So I'll show you that. All right, so I'm gonna leave it off for like a few seconds. I checked out the support manual that came with the machine and I did everything right. So I double checked. It didn't really have any tips for troubleshooting in case the machine would not pair. And then I checked out Brother's website and it also was not helpful at all. I found a page about connecting this machine again. It's like, you know, try it again, but it, literally nothing really helpful. So I've also resorted, I, you know, I know I've recommended you contact the Brother Support Center. Well, I'm about to get some firsthand experience because I tried to email them tonight telling them about what's happening here. Okay, so the machine is on again. So let's try to pair this again. Okay, all right, so we're gonna click Bluetooth model. But yeah, I don't, I'm actually thinking at this point it's not the machine. Let me know if you have any other possibilities or theories on this, but I think it might be an issue with the app. All right, let's do this. Because again, it is detecting the machine. It just can't pair properly with the machine. I'm wondering if this is like an outage that is affecting more customers than just me. It's Sunday night at this point, so I don't know. But if it is, again, I think it's pretty crappy that if the app has a problem or if there's a technical issue on Brother's side or with just weird technical issues in general, then anyone that owns a machine like this just can't use it. Also, if there's a power outage, you can't use it. 
if there's an internet, you know, if there's a cell phone outage or something like that, you also cannot use the machine. So that kind of sucks. All right. Yeah, it's just not, it's not doing anything guys. So this is not a good update. I was hoping to shoot some videos with this thing and try out some different materials. I was going to try fleece. I was going to try canvas. I was going to do some applique. I've got some cool stuff here. So at this point, like, I don't know what else I can do. You know what I'm saying here? So let me know what you think, but this is pretty, pretty, yeah. Not a good sign here. And I've only owned this machine for like less than a week. And I'm already, I am running into some problems. And looking back on this too, I have run into some connectivity issues with the PE900. That one is Wi-Fi and not Bluetooth. But I've had some weird issues with connecting that to the app as well, or even to the brother transfer or like software stuff. So I've had some problems with both of those machines. And I think that really makes me appreciate the PE800 and the PE900 that have a USB slot. So if this one just had a USB slot and an on machine interface, like an onboard interface, I would be able to embroider stuff right now. But since this one runs on the darn app, I'm literally like helpless. I can't do anything. You know, I'm kind of in a holding pattern. So that's kind of frustrating. And yeah, it's a little bit, it's pretty annoying. I have a $500 machine right now and I just freaking can't use it. So that's always fun. So this is me, this is the phone, and I've tried everything. I've tried everything I can think of. If you can think of something else, like, let me know. I can't think of a single thing that I can do more than I already have. So I don't know what to do at this point. I have another video I can shoot that doesn't involve this machine, but it is pretty frustrating as a customer, especially, here's the thing, especially if you're paying the $12.99 per month for Arts Piera Plus, like you shouldn't run into this. Like that's pretty unacceptable. So, all right, let's try to pair it one more time. We'll like, yeah, we'll see what happens, but this is not, I've tried to pair this machine like 20 times at this point, a lot. So I don't know what else I can do. I'm doing everything I'm supposed to. And I had no issues the first few times I used the machine. So like, it shouldn't be this hard. It really shouldn't be this hard. And it did say too, you have to be careful if you have a other like Bluetooth equipment around and stuff. But I had all of this stuff in the vicinity the other day when I paired the machine with no problem. Problem. So I'm thinking it's not even that. I'm theorizing that there is some sort of problem with the app itself right now. And yeah, I don't even know. So I've emailed brother support. I will keep everyone updated to see like what ended up being the cause. But as of now, I literally can't embroider a darn thing. And I've got a useless piece of equipment right here that I, you know, can't do much with. So that is my current situation with the sketch. I feel like sketch should be a verb. Maybe like I'm gonna sketch. I know that sounds really, really lame. But anyways, let me know what you think down below in the comments. And I would uh, very much appreciate a thumbs up on the video if you found it helpful or you can at least commiserate and check out some of the other videos I've already done on the Skitch Embroider Machine and the Art Spear Plus app. I've got a few. I was gonna shoot more tonight, but I guess I can. But I'll see you guys in the next one. And remember, whatever you're doing, make it fun.